What's going on, family? Welcome back to Monday Mindset Drip. I want to say thank you for those who continue to support me by liking, loving, subscribing, and commenting below every time you see this video, if you haven't already, hint, hint. So thank you for all of that. Today, I wanted to talk about, as you know, I do these different mindset videos so that every Monday you have something to start your um, week off with. So you started off with the right mentality, you kind of sort of have like a, a better week. So I thought about what is one thing I can share with you all today It's going to help you have a just more prosperous week. And what I thought about was routines, game plans. And that's one thing I follow. For one, it's in the military, so you know I like different things, structure, game plans. But also, too, I learned that actually helped me out in the civilian life as well. Because when you don't have a game plan or some type of routine, you just pretty much just going with the flow of things, just going, don't really have a direction. But once you start to write down things and have a game plan to get towards it, you're going to notice it comes to you a lot more naturally, right? And the journey is a lot more smoother. So what I want to tell you today is like, give me an example. Like, what is it that Keish routine is that she does every day? But although no, I am human, so I might miss one or two days. But if I miss one or two days, I'm right back on it. Trust me, okay? Because I, I love my routines. So one thing I do is in the morning, I get up, I got a 10-minute meditation that I do, and it helps me get through the day. It helps me start my day off right because now I'm getting my breathing together, okay? I'm starting to, like, just digress with everything, and now I'm starting to start off with a more positive mindset from a 10-minute meditation. You'll be surprised. You might start with a five-minute meditation, but just sitting there in silence and doing your breath work is going to make an entirely different day. Go help you start your day off just phenomenal, okay? The next thing I normally do after I finish my meditation is I go ahead and start doing some cardio. A lot of times, you see me post on Instagram and Facebook that I'm doing, it, I'm doing a treadmill. Today, I got a chance to get outside and hit the track. Yesterday, got a chance to get some stretch training in. Thus, these muscles, you see them coming in? Coming in nice, I know. So, after I finish my cardio or finish my working out, the next thing I do, of course, is stretch, right? If I'm doing like the foam roll or maybe I might do a, a yoga stretch or just as long as I get at least a 10 minute stretch in, I'm feeling good. So now I started my day off right. Okay, you gotta get up kind of early to do this because you got other stuff going on throughout the day, but my day has started off right. So now I'm feeling good, right? The energy is moving through my body. So now I can start moving on and doing my next step. The next thing I normally do is I sit down and I write in my journal, okay? People do this different ways. Me, what I normally start off with is gratitude. I write 10 things I'm grateful for, okay? The next thing I go ahead and do is do some affirmations because you got to get your affirmations in there like the I am healthy, I am wealthy, I'm a money magnet, I'm abundance, you know? We get your affirmations in there. The next thing I do is I write down my affirmation for today. Me, I do a lot of marketing. So one of my affirmations I do is like a, like a positive question because you know you tend to ask yourself a question, you tend to also answer it. So one of mine that I love to do is why is it so easy for me to attract quality leads into my business, right? That's my affirmation because I like to do a lot of marketing. After that, I normally go ahead and write down whatever my goal is. So I start off with, I am so happy and grateful now, and I go ahead and write whatever that goal is. So I normally write it quite a few times, and I end it off with a thank you, I say it is done, so I'm to beat. I'm sorry, that's my end that I put on. You put your little twist to it as well. And then I go ahead and get started with whatever my mindset is for today. So it might be a video. I go ahead and read, you know, it might be YouTube. It might be some type of audio. It's something that I do for the next 10 minutes to now get my mind ready. Cause first I started off with the, you know, making sure I'm at peace, getting my breath work right. Next I moved on here to getting the energy, getting the energy flowing by doing some cardio. Next I moved on to now the mindset part by making sure I'm doing my gratitude doing my affirmations, my affirmations, you know, get doing all of that type of stuff and write my goal down. And then now I'm reading and also watching something positive. So now by the time of nine o'clock, nine o'clock in the morning, I say, sometimes you got started early, depending on how your day works. Now I'm ready. Now I'm ready to give out to you all, pour out to you all, ready to start my trading day, ready to start doing everything. Cause now I'm good to go for the day. So if you haven't already started some type of routine, okay, it can be, it don't have to be as in depth as mine, but start something, you're gonna notice it feels good when you sit down at nighttime, you're like, okay, what did I do today? And you start naming it. I did my meditation, I know I did that. I did my cardio, I did this, I did my mindset, I did. You're already starting to name like five or six things before you even started your day that you had already knocked out. So when you start your day off with that, you know how it makes you feel the rest of the day knowing that you already started your day off right? Everything else flows. So if you're in traffic, people cutting you off, you're not even worried about it because you're like, yeah, I started my day off good. I'm feeling good. You get to work, you're like, man, such and such done tipped you off for the day. Try to use the right words. Tipped you off for the day. You're like, 
Man, you better be glad I started my day off right, cause whew, cause when you start your day off right, man, nothing to nothing that comes into your path can really upset you because you've already started your day off with the proper mindset. So if you haven't already, go ahead for the rest of the week, write out a few things that you can do before well, once you get up in the morning that's really gonna set your day off right. Even if it's five minutes of meditation, five minutes of sitting in silence, just start off with something and I promise you, your day is gonna be phenomenal, okay? So I hope you found some type of value in this video. Before I step out, you know it's time for the plug of the day. And you know what it is, you already know. You already know about pull it up, boom. If you haven't already ordered your copy of my action journal, you got this. It's 100 daily keys to achieving the life you desire. In this, it's like I call it the action journal because what I did was put together 100 different keys that has helped me reach a point one in my life. And you see, you can also write in it. So every day I give you an action step because it's all about taking action. And once you finish 100 days, I promise you, you're gonna be well on way to achieving the life that you deserve. So if you haven't already ordered your copy of You Got This, my first book, make sure you go ahead and go to Amazon. You're gonna see it in the description of this video. Or you also just search my name, Makisha Styles on Amazon, and you'll see it as well. So thank you so much for those that already have supported and left your reviews and everything. Thank you. And I'm looking forward to seeing you all next week and also hearing about the routines that you started to help, you know, have your day go phenomenal. Okay? So have a blessed, prosperous, and wonderful rest of the week. And I will see you all on the next episode of Monday Mindset Drip.